Um, so this is basically just so you can know which cranny nerves have like uh, GSE, G, G, I mean SSA and all that kind of stuff. Um, and I emailed it to Dr. Lou. I can email it to you all because I typed it up uh, this morning. Um, but the first thing you want to do, you want to say, save Virginia, save vase. So when you say that, you write save, like S-A-V-E, and Virginia, like the state, is V-A. Save Virginia, and then save vase. S-A-V-E-V-A-S-E, -S -S -E, like the vase that you put flowers in or something. And then after that, what you'll do, you'll go back and you fill in three S's. One, two, three, and then four G's. Did everybody understand the save the junior save base part? Okay. And then it's basically like you're telling a story about your brother. You're telling somebody about your brother. So you'll say, I have a brother. He is 28 years old. So here you write 28. He lives at 51, 53 Crossroads. So when you say Crossroads, just put like in, a, just don't put anything in. Um, so I have a brother, he's 28 years old, he lives at 5153 Crossroads. And then you go over here to the far right column, um, and then you say to yourself, um, my brother, he likes all the factors of the number 12 except 2. So all the factors of 12, you don't include 2, you have 3, 4, 6, 12, and then you say for some strange reason he likes the number 11, so just write that down. And then the last thing you do, you go back in, you fill in 7, 9, 10 for all the columns except the first one. 7, 9, 10, 7, 9, 10, 7, 9, 10. So over here at SSA, you're only going to have two. These are the special sensory afferent sight and, uh, what did you say, Robert? Sight and sound? Yeah. Sight and sound. So those, and all the numbers represent cranial nerves. So if you kind of forget, have a test question or something, you can kind of jot this out real quick and uh, get all your questions right. <laughs>